Evening guys, how are you doing? It's Nestastic back again with another gameplay. And uh, as I've got the PS2 for a bit until I have to send it back and get a refund, I thought, you know what? Time crisis. Two. I want to crack on the old Time Crisis 2 and do a gameplay. Because you know how much I love Time Crisis, so uh, here we go, let's get stuck in, see how I get on. I've had a quick practice run, I did quite well, so fingers crossed it goes to plan. I didn't realise you could use a dual shock as a pedal to start with either. Which, uh, doesn't half help a lot. Oh, yep. So I'm trying to shoot around the camera, which uh, is not going to be easy by the look of it. Oh, go to story mode. Yeah, let's see how we get on. Absolutely brilliant game this is. It's absolutely arcade perfect. It's just like having the cabinet in your home. Just wish I had a bigger screen. <laughs> Alright, we'll skip the story because we'll be all bloody night boss. Alright, here we go. So the graphics look absolutely superb on this game. Really impressive. Some cracking light effects later on as well. I'm trying to concentrate the best I can because otherwise I'm going to pop this up. Oh, you bastard. Not, not so good at dodging the bloody explosives and water. So I'm trying to aim the gun over the camera, which is uh, proving quite difficult. Oh, the glass shatters, that looks pretty cool. If you haven't got this already guys, definitely go and pick it up. If you're a light gun fan like I am, then this is an absolute must have. I can't believe I just got shot in the bloody face. I love the original time class, but for me this is the best time version so far. I mean I've not played number 3 yet though, or number 4, so we'll wait and wait and see. I've only played the original time classes, time classes project Titan. And of course this one time process too. So once I get to play three and four, I'll know for definite which one play it and I'm gonna die now. Bastard. Shit. I can't believe it's done. Alright, area one complete. Let's go. The music's really cool, it's proper 80s arcade style, I love it. Well it's not an 80s game, but it sounds like one. Oh, and he got caught out by the babble thing. Oh, look at that, nice bit of shooting. Oh, look at that, no problem. It's shooting boss in the face. It's like shooting fish in a barrel, this bit. Oh, friggin' hell, they didn't even see him. Where did he come from? So, no problem getting cockered. As soon as you get cocky, I'll mess this up. Oh, you. Oh, I love bloody red guys. Oh, I shot my man in the face. <laughs> Hang on, the gun's going off a bit here, that's better. Gotta aim a little higher because I keep, sh I keep shooting my camera. <laughs> oh, for Christ's sake. I'd right say so the G-Pun 2 is really accurate, it's really nice. It's nice and small and all really compact and it fits, fits nicely in the hands. Just feels really good. 
I'm looking forward to trying the uh, G Clan 3, which gives you time passes for when the G Clan. No, you don't actually get G Clan 2, time passes for time. G Clan 3 comes with time passes 4, I apologise for that. The G Clan 3 looks really weird, it's got like a, a laser sight being attached to the bottom, which I don't really know what the hell it's for. But I saw it on Mark Bahir's gameplay and I was like, oh, you shit. I need to find out what that's for. I'm really playing badly. My first go before I started recording, I was kicking ass, I got quite far. Not as far as I'd like that. Oh, machine gun! Oh, I knew it, I just knew I was gonna get a grenade in the face. You shit. There we go, got it. 4-4 is dead in there. That music's just so cool. Alright, I chased the boss down to the docks. Yeah, whatever, let's get on with it. Right, nice little water effects. Not too bad at all for the old PS2. Straight out. This bit's really hard because I can't seem to get the aim off. The bloody boats are everywhere all over the shop. I'm playing. I'm doing it much better than I did last time. I thought I'd eat anything last time. Well, I'll say that the CPU is uh, playing really shit. You know, we don't fire at all, or we just miss it a lot. Gazers coming out of the water. That bastard always gets me in the face of these ones. He's wobbling, so it's really hard to try and hit his boss. Oh, you git, I knew he was going to get me. Oh, no, I'm just son of a bitch. Ah, oh, I got him, there you go. Tosser. Oh, I'll skip this, because this, this uh, FMV goes on for quite a long time. Stage two. Okay, we're going to fight in the woods now. One of my favourite parts of the game is just. I love the lighting coming through the trees, that's fantastic. That is. I just love lighting on games, you really just can't get bored of playing them. They're just such great fun, it's such simplistic arcade. Fun. Oh, you bastard. They translate so well to the home as well. Especially time crisis titles anyway. Time crisis in the case of the dead are the best, I think. You bastard. Oh, I missed that yellow one. I think you get a time bonus for it, didn't you? Oh, come on. Oh, someone's got to shoot me. Still can't hit the ones in the back. No! Oh, that was easy, isn't it? Oh, beautiful. Okay guys, well I'm going to have to wrap it up there because we're about to run out of 10 minutes unfortunately, but uh, yeah, I had a few nice tastes of time classes too on the PS2, so 
absolutely brilliant game. If you love live on games or time parties, this is the one to go for. So, thanks for watching, and uh, I'll see you all again soon.